Next up, we have M-O-N-M-H-11, Heroes and Superheroes. Now, this category is open to all kinds of heroes as well as superheroes. So what is a hero? Well, somebody like Achilles is a hero. However, a superhero would be somebody like Superman or Batman. A regular hero would be Tarzan or Sinbad. So that's the sort of thing we are looking for. Now, without further ado, let's check out the amazing models in this category right now. Mark says, starting with a 116th scale Polar Lights reissue of Dick Tracy, I widened the hat brim and altered the suit jacket into an overcoat with Ave's epoxy sculpt two-part epoxy putty. Styrene bits were used to convert Tracy's pistol into the Hornet's gas gun as seen in the 1940s movie serial. A 1 16th scale Tamiya World War II German Wehrmacht tank crewman was the basis for Cato. The standing figure's limbs were repositioned to fit into the fire escape. The scars from surgery and details of Cato's outfit were also sculpted with Aves. The base was changed to resemble an alley seen in the serial. And weren't those models amazing? Actually, we only had one entry in this category, and that was Mark McGovern. So without further ado, let's find out where Mark stands in the standings by simply saying, Floyd, hand me that letter. And here we have the letter from our good friend Floyd. Now let's find out where the rankings are in this fierce competition. Coming in with a gold, we have Mark McGovern for the Green Hornet and Kato. Let's give a big hand for Mark McGovern. Here's his hand. All right. Now, if you want to check out our final category, which is MON MH12 busts, check it out by clicking this video right here.